Hi everyone, it's Jerry. I was just doing a group of chess puzzles and came across this one and it turned out to be an endgame study and I found it appropriate for this playlist, this uh, cool chess puzzles playlist. Certainly very clever. Um, it's a endgame study or a composition by A. Prokop. I'm unaware of the year it was created and or published. If you have those details, feel free to inform me in the comments, and I'll be sure to update uh, update the description and a title to this video. But anyhow, it's a white to move in this one. Um, if you'd like to, go ahead and pause the video, see if you can find the solution to this one. Okay. Uh, the solution here is to first take on a3. There's only two moves to really consider as black. Uh, the best move is to take on a3. Playing b3, there now follows bishop to e5. Just preparing to stop the pawn from advancing, so black has to take. And now white is in fact going to be pushing through and getting the queen with check. Black will promote first, but white again will get the queen with check. And after a couple key checks, um, let's say queen c4, you can now push through and it gets a little bit more complicated, but in the end, white is of course the uh, better side here, the winning side. Uh, they will be promoting soon enough, getting another queen. So, that said, you have to take on a3 instead of playing b3. And now the timing is super important here. Black is now working with a passed rook pawn which means when they promote it will be with check. So what to do here? Playing this move bishop e5 is no longer working because again black will be promoting with check and they're in a position to stop queening. So you play the move king to a8. How clever is that? Very uh, sneaky move. Black is needing to push. The threat here is bishop a7, bishop d4, stopping the pawn from promoting. So you need to push right away. a2, bishop a7 still, and now what to do is black. You have to promote yet again. And the big question here is what to promote to exactly. The typical promotion to a queen, this is now stalemate. And similarly, promoting to a rook, that stalemate, and going to any one of two minor pieces. Let's start off first with the knight. This is the trickiest. Go figure. Promoting to a knight, this will result in a draw. Initially, I thought it would be a white win, but black is in time to hunt down the f-pawn, like so, and will be in a position to control the g8 square, pivoting on either e7 or h6 to do so. Um... If bishop here to kind of box the knight out, well, when this pawn pushes, h6 is no longer defended by the bishop. So um, that will, the short story here is promoting to a knight is a draw. And one last promotion, promoting to a bishop here. There's now yet another cool move, bishop d4. And you have to capture the bishop. And this is yet again another instance of stalemate. So. Uh, this was um, a very spur-of-the-moment uh, video here. Uh, again, like I said, I was just doing a group of puzzles and came across this one. It turned out to be a study and a cool one at that. Um, so hopefully you enjoyed it. Feel free to leave any comments in the comments section below to this video. And as always, I hope you enjoyed it. That's all for now. Take care. Bye.